Good morning everyone, uh, I think all remote centers can uh, hear me and they can see me. So uh, we will just have a quick clicker demo as we have had earlier and I believe that nearly all remote centers have finished with their clicker installations. So uh, since Monday we will be using clickers regularly in our sessions. So this will be a final demonstration just to check that all of you have uh, working clicker installations and uh, not facing any problems. Uh, on the screen I have displayed one question, so uh, this is how it will look like in uh, all your clicker sessions also, this is a simple question. So uh, uh, the question here says what will be the output of the following code, this code is in C and if you compile and run this code then what will be the output, uh, okay everyone. So. Um, uh, couple of things first, uh, some of the centers have received the second trench of clickers, so I believe they would have around uh, 25 to 30 clickers now. Uh, it is uh, for those centers also we have received the student list, but it may not have been updated in the database right now. So I just request all the coordinators to distribute the clickers among the participants. Uh, do not worry about what clickers to give to which participant, just distribute them randomly. To all the participants, uh, I just want you to read the instructions if you can on the top of the screen. This is how you have to choose your response. Uh, if you look at the clicker, there is a, a start key, ST key. You press the ST key, then choose one of the responses A, B, C or D and then press the lock key. Okay. Uh, one thing is there that uh, the response whatever you choose, it remains valid for 30 seconds. Okay, so uh, please don't choose it now. I request all the coordinators to first distribute the clickers among the participants. When all the participants have understood the instructions, I request the coordinator to ask all the participants to choose their responses and within 30 seconds, the coordinator should press the collect response key on their computer. So I just request everyone to do that. I will give you about 30 seconds or uh, a minute of time so that I can uh, check the responses here. Uh, one thing I wanted to uh, ask the coordinators, if they have any trouble reading the question then I want you to raise your hand here because uh, we are not sure if the coordinate, if the centers are receiving the uh, display properly. So with the current color uh, of the font and with the background contrast everything, if anybody has any problem reading the question or reading the responses or seeing the instructions, I want you to raise your hand and let me know. Uh, okay, uh, the question yes, the, the question is, I will just repeat it, uh, the question is what will be the output of the following C code, if you compile it and run, uh, the window is a little small but this is the main question, it uh, starts with void main and the last statement is printf, okay, after that there is just a close parenthesis, so this is the main question, what will be the output of this C C code. Yeah, I understand the question is not visible on the screen fully, but uh, can everyone read the question? It is okay if the question is not visible fully because this is not resizable, we will change it later on. But are people able to read the font in the question? Only if you have, if you cannot read the font, you let me know. Okay, uh, it is okay if you cannot see this list. This list is actually for the lecturer only. So uh, I can just tell you what is there on this list. This list actually displays from which centers we have received the responses and I can see about 5, uh, 4, 7, about from only from 10 centers we have received the responses. Okay, I am getting a query from the PhD college saying that how to collect clicker responses. So uh, I think you, you should have got the manual link by now and uh, you should have got the instructions on how to use the clicker remote software by now. You just open the screen, you enter the quiz number which is being displayed on the top of the question and then you press collect responses. Uh, I am not sure whether it will work the first time because if you are asking me that how to collect clicker responses then probably you have not tested the application even once by now. I request you to do that immediately. Okay, we have received responses from a couple of more centers. I believe some of the centers are behind a proxy and are still facing uh, network problems. Okay, I'll, uh, my colleagues has a list of centers. Uh, 
which they have been in touch with and uh, we just have uh, the status of each center. So I, I just go over each centers from which we haven't received the responses and uh, just like to ask what problems they are facing with it. Oh, okay, I'll just go over each center one by one. Uh, SVNIT Surat, uh, can you just raise your hand and tell me what problem you are facing because uh, I understand that yesterday you had said that it was working fine. So can you tell me what, what is the problem that you are facing right now? Okay, we'll just go to Swin IIT Surat. Hello? Yes, Swin IIT Surat. Am I audible to you? Yes, yes, go ahead. Uh, what problem are you no, facing? Yeah, uh, uh, this, this receiver, yeah, receiver machine is not being uh, connected to FTP server of your clicker. Okay, what is the error we that you We locally got the response in from our participants, could not connect. Uh, could not connect to FTP server? Yes. Can you try once again? Just I ask us your two, part. Times also I sent mail to the clickers. Uh, okay, because I believe the FTP server is fine. Uh, we have received responses from a lot of centers. So, uh, either your network connection is very slow or there is some other problem. So. Uh, since yesterday, uh, yesterday it was working fine. I just request you to try once again. Okay. Okay. Uh, we'll just go over to the next center. Uh, Somaya College, uh, Somaya Vidya Vihar. Hello. Hello, Somaya Hello. College. Yes. Hello. Yes, I can hear you. Yeah, uh, if our software is not able to connect the responses. But before this, up, before the start of the session, we checked that time it was working properly. Now we started, it is not able to collect the responses. Uh, can you just check all the hardware wiring, uh, some hardware wiring might have come off. Just check it again. Okay, okay, we are checking it. Uh, it when it says that it, uh, to, it I just uh, want to tell this to all centers. If you receive a message which says could not collect responses, that means the software is not able to communicate with the hardware. So just check your hardware wiring some wire might have come off or the power cable for the receiver might have come off or it is not properly connected to the computer port. So just verify it and uh, for those centers for which we have not received responses, just try once again. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, we can, can we go to VJTI? Uh, VJTI, can you hear me? Anyways, uh, yeah, go ahead with your problem. As such, we don't have any problem. Oh, only thing is for uploading it, we have some issues in the FTP that we will sort it out in the this afternoon. Okay, that's fine. Right now we are able to collect the things in the local file. Okay. Uh, all right. Okay. I request VJTI that you please uh, resolve this issue because uh, since Monday we'll be having regular sessions. So I don't want you to face any problems then. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. Today afternoon this will be corrected and we'll get back to you on this. Okay. Thank you VJTI. Okay. Can we go to SGSIT Indore? Sir, actually uh, we had some problem with the FTP and so we had agreed to the point that we will be sending the responses through mail. Okay. Are you waiting, sir? Okay. Uh, I believe you are behind a proxy server, right? So, I, I, hello. Yes, sir. Might be that is the problem. Okay. Uh, well, that problem can be resolved actually if you can talk to your administrator, just ask him to put your machine uh, with a no proxy setting, okay? You can specify an IP for your machine and it can put a no proxy setting. Uh, sorry for the interruption. I'd like to say that we are out of proxy now and uh, we had agreed to the point uh, yesterday that we will be sending our responses through mail. So I just wanted to know that whether you have received our mail or not. Uh, okay, all right, fine. Uh, so this is for all centers also. I mean, uh, worst case scenario, if your FTP is not working, we will be able to collect responses through email. Uh, right now, we are not displaying them here, but uh, uh, from Monday onwards, we will be do it, uh, able to do it. It is not a very good way of doing it because we have to manually uh, save your files in a folder and then read it in our software. So just try to get your networks up and running if possible. Otherwise, uh, sending emails to clicker at IIT with your responses is the last option. Okay, uh, can we go to VIT Vellore? Uh, VIT Vellore, can you hear me? Uh, tell me what your problem is with the clicker installation. Okay, uh, Vellore, I can see your machine. Uh, 
so it seems your hardware is working fine but you cannot connect to the ftp server okay uh, i believe that uh, we have received uh, responses from all the working colleges we uh, so there are some uh, some colleges have st uh, are still facing issues uh, some are behind some are behind the ftp proxy so i request that uh, just just try and talk to your administrator if they can give you a uh, no proxy for your machine's ip otherwise you will have to send emails which will not be very convenient for you also because uh, you know during the lecture uh, probably the lecturer will give only 30 seconds or a minute for each question so by the time you send your email and we receive your email and put it here uh, your college might already get skipped so just try and see if you can uh, uh, yes, Amravati, uh, yes, you are being sent a new receiver. It has already been couriered to you. I think you should uh, receive it in a one, or, uh, one or two days, uh, probably by Monday or Tuesday. So just request you to you know, wait till then. Uh, also, I would request you to get in touch with our uh, team at clicker.it as soon as you get your receiver so that we can help you in setting it up. Okay. Uh, all the colleges uh, who have some queries regarding clickers, uh, in a minute we will start the G talk for clicker. So they can just post their queries on that. I believe some colleges are having problems. They are saying that uh, they don't know the FTP server IP. Or, so uh, for the colleges that we have received the responses, this is how it will look like. Uh, the lecturer can check your responses here. and. Uh, it will show all the clicker IDs along with the response. I think this screen will not be very clear for you now. Uh, we will just increase the font and try to change the contrast a little bit. But this is what it will look like. So I believe most of you have answered A, uh, but the correct answer is C. Okay, so uh, I think this session was successful. Uh, again, I request all the colleges which are facing problems to just uh, log in on GTalk or send a mail at clicker.idt and we'll just get back to you, okay?